Piper Sonoma was founded in 1980 by the Marquis Francois Dolan in Sonoma, California, whose champagne roots span generations. The De Suarez Dolan family has been known to be very powerful throughout the second millennium and have an effect on European history. The family's link dates back to the very first power families in Europe. The Marquis Dolan's vision was to create world-class sparkling wines in the new world using traditional old world winemaking techniques. The early 80s saw the movement of French champagne producers into Northern California, particularly Sonoma and Napa counties. The French brought their traditional winemaking techniques of method champenois to California's new frontier. Nearly 40 years later, Piper Sonoma was one of the first brands to be established and continues to realize the Marquis' vision under the guidance of longtime sparkling winemaker Keith Hawk. The Piper Group selected Sonoma County for the diversity of vineyards. Sonoma County is large in scale, and with that large growing area, you have a diversity of growing sites. We started in Sonoma County with the, the idea that we're Piper Sonoma. And to this day, we source fruit exclusively in Sonoma County. What makes Sonoma unique is really the diversity. We can have the cool sites out along the coast or down in the Sonoma Carneros that have long growing seasons that give you great flavors, huge amount of acidity, which is critical to sparkling wine. We have a very diverse growing area between Sonoma County, close to the Pacific Ocean. These warmer areas will offer you a fruit profile, more tropical flavors, the coastal climate where we have more citrus driven uh, characters. But it's the size of the county that gives us the ingredients. We're able to, to get ripeness, flavor development because we're in California. We have warm days, sunny weather, and uh, cool nights that just provide us with the right recipe of ingredients to make dynamic sparkling wines. So the grapes that we work with for our sparkling wines is Chardonnay, primarily, Pinot Noir, and then and Pinot Blanc. And out of those grapes, we make our flagship wine, which is this Piper Sonoma Brut. We also make a Piper Sonoma Rosé and a Piper Sonoma Blanc de Blanc. And those have been the mainstay for the last almost 40 years. So there's a lot of history. There's a lot of customer expectation that these wines are consistent and high quality each year. Can you talk to me a little bit about uh, Method Champenois? Sure, so Method Traditional is the, the method that the finest wines in the world, Champagne, is produced using. So we harvest the grapes at night where it's still cool under lights, whole cluster. The grapes are put into to what we call half-ton macro bins and then taken to the winery. We dump them whole cluster into the press. We press them gently to get the finest juice that has the brightest flavors, best acidity. And then we'll ferment them in stainless steel tanks and barrels, like some houses do in, in Champagne. Once we assemble the blend, we'll add a little bit of sugar and yeast back to the, the wine before it goes to bottle. And then in the bottle, it goes to the second fermentation. The next step is the aging process. The wines will age in the cellar, developing more flavor on the yeast, but you develop flavor from those yeast cells that die off in the bottle. We call that entourage. The final step is disgorging where the cork goes in, dosage, which gets a little bit of a mixture of sugar, wine, to balance the wine out before it goes to market. What is the secret to making a high quality, consistent wine like you're able to do at Piper Sonoma year after year after year? We work with family-owned vineyards that uh, really are, are committed to growing the best grapes for sparkling wine. In the, the history of, of Piper Sonoma, we've gone from, from growers that are fathers down to the sons or down to, to grandchildren. It's relationships. We deal by uh, conversations on the phone. These are real people and real connections on how we get this done. Talk a little bit about the relationships that you personally have and, and what it means to be part of this team. We do feel like we're a family. I mean, there's many of us that work with this brand for a very long time. We care about where the wine is going, how it's produced, and all the quality and time that goes into it. You know, the connection is walking through the vineyards, seeing the soil, tasting the grapes, talking to the people that are doing the work in the vineyards, and really trying to get the best out of everything we do. We're producing world-class sparkling wines. We have a commitment to quality. We have a strong consumer expectation. And for me, making wines is always about quality, doing the very best that I can. We're just at a point today where, you know, we're looking to the future, trying to take this wine to the next 30 or 40 years. Piper Sonoma is a, a wine that you can be 
there for all the great moments, for the weddings, for the uh, birthdays, but it really is about just bringing people together and that's the great thing about Piper Sonoma. Nearly 40 years of consistency of high quality wines that are accessible and available to everyone. I'll drink to that. I'll drink to that too.